டியர் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் இன்னைக்கு நம்ம பார்க்க போற டாபிக் வந்து இஸ்லாமிக் சிஸ்டம் ஆஃப் எஜுகேஷன் அதுக்கு முன்ன இந்த இஸ்லாம் அதை பத்தி நீங்க தெரிஞ்சுக்கணும் த வேர்டு இஸ்லாம் ஹேஸ் பீன் டெரைவ்டு ஃப்ரம் அரபிக் வேர்டு சலாம் மீன்ஸ் சலாம் மீனிங் பீஸ் கம்ப்ளீட் சப்மிஷன் டு காட் and unbreakable by stones of ignorance its latest version as we see islam today was introduced in mecca in 610 ad by prophet muhammad avar yarana he was a person to be praised he was called sadiq sadiq abina truth speaking apn artham and amin அதாவது கம்ப்ளீட்லி ஹானஸ்ட் பிஃபோர் இஸ் ப்ராஃபிட் ஹுட் அதுக்கு முன்னாடி அவரை வந்து ஒரு இஸ்லாமிய தூதுவராக அனௌன்ஸ் பண்ணுறதுக்கு முன்னாடி எப்போ அனௌன்ஸ் பண்ணாங்களோ அவருடைய ஃபார்ட்டி இயர்ஸ் தான் அட் ஏஜ் ஆஃப் ஃபார்ட்டி ஹி வாஸ் அனௌன்ஸ்ட் அஸ் ப்ரொஃபெட் ஹுட் பை த பீப்புள் ஆஃப் மெக்கா அதுக்கு முன்னாடி அவர் என்ன சொல்லிட்டு இருந்தாங்க சாதிக் அப்படின்னு சொல்லிட்டு இருந்தாங்க அதாவது ட்ரூத் ஸ்பீக்கிங் அப்புறம் ஆமீன் அப்படின்னு சொல்லிட்டு இருந்தாங்க Muhammad was born in Mecca in the family of Hasim in 570 AD. He was always in search of truth and used to go to Hira mountain till he was appointed apostle by his god. Kadavulala thuduvaraga avaru niyamikkapaduvatharku munba enna pannittirundare mountain ella therinjittirundare eda thedi unmai thedi. Basic talent of Islamic world view man is a creation of god who can choose to conform to his ordinates idhila sala points solladu enna na man has intelligence will and speech but man is also weak and forgetful man kitta vande arivu irukku nambike irukku pesa kodi thanmai irukku ana adhe samayathula avan eppadi pattara weak avum irukkara marudiyagum irukkara through revelations guidance we can he can seek to overcome his imperfections adutha the conformity with the gods will determine a man's destiny in this life and the next third point the right way to live is according to god's will which he has revealed through the prophets adutha point islam is a restatement of what god has to say to man as a set of beliefs law is prescribed in islam for every sphere of life law islam has provided the social framework for a great culture for more than a thousand years the muslim world is one unit islam is not only to be appraised of even carefully acquainted with its pattern institutions and history but also to apprehend what these mean to those who have the faith if a future of islam adha pathi varusa paakalam enna enna irukke ethana points irukke appdin paathinga na motha or aaru points irukku adha enna enna appingala modala solidren islam is universal islam is comprehensive islam is eternal Islam is dynamic Islam is rational and Islam is realistic ipo onna onna paakalam Islam is universal the islamic system is such that it makes all men as one community and does not make any distinction on the basis of language race color culture or history adutha islam is comprehensive it provides a complete code of contact for living it is not merely for individuals but nation as well adutha point islam is eternal from the beginning of the universe islam has been the only true religion islam is not a novel religion that appeared in arabia four centuries ago preached by the prophet muhammad It is a region God made known on the day when man first appeared on the earth. Islam is dynamic. Islam is not a static religion. 
its principles are not confined to any one particular period of history or particular set of circumstances. Islamic principles cannot be outdated. They are capable of meeting the demands of the modern age. Islam is rational. Several verses quoted from Holy Quran and the sayings from Prophet clearly ask human beings to observe, to this to analyze and to judge. All these are symptoms of rationalism and reasoning. Islam is realistic. Islam is a religion which does not make discrimination between theory and the practice. It does prohibit from such action, which is difficult to do. Islam knows the characteristics and nature of human beings. Islam does not make any distinctions on the basis of color. Islam considers all human beings on the same footing and does not discriminate on the score of color. Islam promotes a harmony between the individual and the society, faith and the science, the material and the spiritual. Now we will the Islamic education in relation to different components of education. Education system was essentially religious in character. It was patronized by the Muslim rulers. The sole aim of Muslim education became spread of Islam, perpetuation and the preservation of Muslim culture. The Muslim rulers and beneficiaries established Maghdabs and Madras, where the study of Holy Quran became a prominent feature. The Islamic laws Opinions, customs, and doctrines were subjects of study, and all students were required to master them. The object of Muslim education was attainment of worldly prosperity and social distinction. The main of education is to understand the relation of man with God as revealed in the Holy Quran. Islam la aims and objectives enna nariya points irukku onna onna paakalam to provide the teachings of holy quran as a first step of education to provide the experiences which are based on fundamentals of islam to provide the experiences in the form of knowledge and the skills with a clear understanding that these experiences are likely to be changed in the light of changes in society. To develop understanding that knowledge without the basis in faith and religion is incomplete education. To develop, it, to develop commitment towards the basic values which have been prescribed in religion and the scripture. To develop sense of accountability towards Almighty Creator so that man passes his life like a faithful servant. To encourage international brotherhood irrespective of differences in generations, occupations and the social class. To foster great consciousness of the divine presence in the universe. To bring man nearer to an understanding of God and of the relation in which man stands to his creator, to develop pity and faith amongst the followers, to produce man who has faith as well as knowledge in spiritual. Added the nature of elementary and higher education, maktaba and primary education. The Maktaba it is an Arabic word which means a place where writing is taught. That is the elementary school. Thus, Maktaba is a place where people learn reading and writing. Here, people are made to learn ayahs and verses of Quran like the Vedic Ubanaya, Ubanaya, Ubanayana, and Buddhist Babaja. In the Islamic education of education is a ceremony called 
Bismillah was performed when the child attained the age of four years, four months, and four days. Islamic education is a function of Bismillah. Yapana or Kolan the order four years, four months, and four days. Ipa curriculum, Islamic and a curriculum. The child was taught the letters of alphabets of Urdu, Persian, and Arabic languages. Recitation sutras are chapters of Quran, stories of Muslim, Fakis, and the poems of Persian poets were also taught. For character building, the books. Kulistan and Boston, written by Sheikh Saudi, were taught. Grammar and literature, history of laws of Islam, logic, philosophy, law, astrology, history, geography, agriculture, Yunani system of medicine. But teaching methods. Relation, learning, kalama, and the collective repetition. Writing, reading, and oral methods, and also monitor methods in maktops and madras. Madrasas. Madrasas and higher education. The word madrasa is derived from Arabic word das, which means a lecture. Thus, madrasasas mean a place where lectures are delivered. Madarsa was an educational institution for imparting Islamic education and higher learning in which students sought admission after completing Maktab education. Lecture method was supplemented by discussions. Duration of education is Madras was 10 to 20 years. Curriculum was divided into two categories, religious education and secular education. Religious education, the contents of religious curriculum included intensive and critical analysis of the Quran, intensive study of Islamic law, Sufism, and the heritage of Muhammad Sahib. Secular education, the contents of secular education included the teaching of languages and literatures of Arabic and Persian, logic, history, geography, astronomy, astrology, arithmetic, agriculture, medicine, economics, ethics, and philosophy. Teaching methods of the Islam in the Lecture method, self-study, and practical method in subjects like music, architecture. Discipline of the Islam in the Education was not imported on psychological line. Students were forced to maintain strict discipline by giving them severe corporal punishments. Trans and delinquents were they severely canned on forms. Good and intelligent students were rewarded. But teacher people relationship every year. The relationship between teachers and students in Muslim period was as cordial as it was during Vedantic and Buddhist period. Students and teachers showed genuine kind of feeling of love and respect. There was constant and intimate relationship between teacher and student. At the point, educational implications of Islamic education. points First point, Partial and useful education. Education was for preparation for the practical life. Education achieved more objectivity. At the point of free education. Education is Magdhavs and Madras. Madrasas was free and compulsory up to elementary level for all Muslim children. Boarding and lodging in Madrasas were also was also free. Individual contact. Education was considered a personal process. The teacher had to live with his peoples. Monitorial system. Monitorial system was also more commonly used. Status of teacher. Teacher had a high status. They commanded respect in the society. We are men of high moral character. Patronage of education. Enjoyed state patronage. Almost all Muslim rulers set up 
madras and madarsa and showed their generosity favor and love for education even learned persons literary people poets etc got patronage and encouragement from states and royal families at the promote promotion of cultural unity no restriction of caste and religion to get admission in madrasas and madarsas madaras madarsas encouragement to persian language and science persian language was a media of education so special emphasis was given on the teaching of arabic and persian language and the study of science subject was emphasized development of literature and history great attention was given to the growth of history and the art of writing history in fact tradition of writing history has its had its roots in this period various form of literatures also underwent significant growth so idoda vande nama enna pandrom islamic system of education oda nam mudikrom adutha class la western schools of philosophy அத பத்தி நம்ம பார்க்க போறோம் புரியுது வெஸ்டர்ன் ஸ்கூல் ஆஃப் பிலாசபி பார்க்கலாமா சரி ஓகே வைண்ட் அப் தேங்க்யூ